as physical a regular season game as you'll see unless you're pleased with the way your guys handled it. Yeah, it was a bloodbath. It was, you know, nip and tuck all the way. I thought our guys met the physicality of the game. Uh, the, you know, officials set the tone of how they were going to call it, and uh, we met it. Um, you know, I was so proud of DeMar DeRozan, you know, with 13 rebounds. was huge. Jonas came in. Uh, you know, we were saying, okay, can he guard Horford out there on the perimeter, you know, shooting the three. But he made up for it with his defense, two big blocks. <coughs> two big blocks. And, uh, you know, 23 rebounds was huge for us. It's not particularly physical often enough, but what, what do you think brought it out tonight? Was physicality? That? Well, again, sometimes, Doug, you get – you know, tired of getting beaten up. You know, if you playing on the playground, when I was little, you get tired of getting beaten up by the bully, and all at once you fight back. And that's what we did. I thought our guys fought back. Uh, Eric asked the question how <clears throat> guys fought back and played through, uh, not lose three games in a row. And I, it says something about our team's character, who they are, their fight, their grit. This is a grind. These are dog days right now for everybody, mentally and physically. You know, some of the plays we made tonight early was like, whoa, where did that come from? I've never seen that before. But <clears throat> the whole league is going through it. I thought our guys fought through it. But, again, it's, it's the culture. It's the, the mental toughness of our guys to fight through nights when you just don't have it mentally or physically. You mentioned <clears throat> JV on Harper. Was that, given how it went down in Boston last time where you had to get Pat on Harper, was that a tough decision for you? And how – Yes, yeah, it was. It, it was. It was. Uh, he responded well. He had thir- 23 rebounds, 18 points, two big blocks, plus 17. He responded well. Again, JV is is improving. He's getting better. Uh, you know, is he a finished product? No, but tonight he was. And uh, you know, Pat <clears throat> has given us what he has. Pat's not 100. percent So, but JV did more than than we could ask for. Seems like Pat. He's not 100. percent Uh, yeah, yeah, he's on a minute restriction, but he's still not 100%. How much do you, and understanding that he wasn't at 100%, how much do you think that second unit misses him? A lot. I think we miss his IQ, we miss his three point shooting, just his overall presence. His chemistry is un- unbelievable with the second unit and with the first unit. So, um, you know, Pat's one of our high IQ players, character players, uh, and I-, I feel for him because he's trying, he's trying to give us everything he has. And uh, and I appreciate that, and I know that you know the organization appreciates that. There would have been a time where Demar might not have taken that contact and finished the game as well as he did. Can you speak to that evolution in him? He did. I mean, again, I don't know if we had the energy Sunday against Houston to fight through it the way we did, but tonight we did. Uh, he had what 11 points at halftime, and just went, you know, just found the the strength and the energy to to take off in the second half through the contact, through the pound, through the hits. Um, and uh, did an excellent job of, of playing through it. You mentioned before the game how this could grow to be a good rivalry. Is this the sort of game No you're question. Of? It is. It, it, uh, Boston's a very good team, well coached team. Um, they're, well, their constitution is tough, physical, hard, and, uh, you know, w- we meet that. And that's, that's, uh, it's gonna, they're going to be our rival for, for a while. Is DeMar's competitiveness a little bit kind of underrated? I mean, he's a pretty low key guy. But- no, he's a tough kid. He, he didn't grow up in Compton for nothing. I mean, he, he's a tough kid. Uh, more than anything else, the 41 points is nice, Michael, but the 13 rebounds, the, the 11 defensive rebounds when we needed it, um, you know, with Pat being not 100% and, uh, you know, they putting two guys on JV trying to keep him out. And, you know, DeMar came in and got some big rebounds, tough rebounds. So that was impressive. That, that was a, more of a sign of grit and grind as much as the 41 points.